So, doing the video, right? I'm trying to ignore because the police officer just asked me for a few dollars. Get out of here. He just, how you asked me for a few dollars? Damn. It's not a game, it's a Frontier, leaving the hotel. I guess that's the back entrance, spiral. Um, leaving the hotel. See, I got my sweater on. I just brought it. Um, when I noticed that my window was the was open, it wasn't completely open, but it was open. It wasn't locked. I then decided. Um, oh, when I noticed it was cracked, I opened the window to feel the temperature and it was cool. So I said, let me bring the sweater instead of bringing the jacket today. Um, if it rains, I'm just gonna have to eat it. But in terms of the temperature, I should be all right. Um, secondly, I used my GPS and I found out that the pyramids are like, like an hour away. So I'm gonna get information about that and I might just go right now. And um, I'm gonna see if it's better to go now than later. Um, countries all over the world have traffic problems, even America. So I don't want a 60 minute to turn into like a two hour drive. So I'm gonna see if it's good. I'm gonna see if we've, I'm gonna see if it's good to go now. So the guy in the hotel said it would be 400 Egyptian pounds. I did the math is like $26. Once again, not a whole lot of money for like an hour plus drive. But as I mentioned to you guys before, you still have to shop around. You still have, so here, here's what you gotta wait. You still gotta shop around because if he's calling his friend, for example, it's like I'm paying the, dr the driver plus I'm, I'm paying the driver plus I'll be paying um, him, you know? Another thing I have to look at is um, on the hotel's part, they'll do a better job. <clears throat> they'll do a better job getting somebody, or take you d directly over there than than me getting somebody on the street. I still haven't stopped the taxi yet, but I think what I'm gonna do is go in the hotel and see if the if he can get the driver to do forty dollars round trip instead of twenty six dollars one way. So I think that's what I'm gonna try to do because the guy will stay there. What I learned so far is most people don't speak English at all. And I wasn't here for long, but I could just tell that that's the case. The guy last night in the hotel, he spoke, he spoke very good language, uh, English. He's a young dude. Um, the guy at the desk now, just a few words to be able to translate, but I could just see that's gonna be an issue. So at least if they bring someone, he, he told me that the, 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 the cab that he's gonna call, the guy speaks English, so that could be, that could be helpful. Um, so if he could do it for $40 round trip, I think I'm gonna go with it, then the, then the 26. No, just transit. Just visit, visit. Rest here. Huh? Come in Cairo for business or for no business? No business. Tourism. Tourist. Yeah, tourist. Brother, 
city of that cemetery. Okay. It's tomb. Okay. See, tomb. Yes. Wow. Everything. Cemetery. Yes, cemetery. Yeah, see. From here. Yes. You want to picture? Yeah, it's okay. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. It's very big. Okay. Yep. You wait for me here, two minutes? Yep. I come to you. Okay. Yep. I come to you quickly. He'll come to me quickly. So, uh, a little bit of a, a mix up, I guess. I don't know how this is gonna come out. I'm filming myself with the GoPro and the phone. So as you can see, the Sphinx is right here. That's the pyramid. I think that skis it right there. And did I miss one? The other ones are past, so I'm waiting for the guide person to come through. Okay, so when you enter the gates, all right, so I'll give you a quick rundown. So I took my taxi. The taxi made a stop at a, um, at a quote unquote museum. It wasn't really a museum. There was like a, for short, let me just say paintings. So I didn't want to buy one. I wound up buying one. I got how she got, she went all the way to like three bucks. So I got it. They put it in a tube, all good. Then the taxi said, all right, cool. We're going to go to the tour guide where it's like one fee to, um, for the, for the camel or the horse and bring you in and whatever. Cool. So I was debating the price. I was, um, with, the, with the gentleman once I got there and before that even started they want you to buy perfume it's, it's like in a lot of these countries just like in Turkey with the guy taking me to a place that sells carpets okay yeah. Hello. this is my cousin Hello, how, are you? how are you doing bro good good Welcome. he will give you perfect information please He's from New York. Oh, that's Hello. nice. Welcome. Thank you. Thank you. He's a YouTuber. <laughs> YouTuber? Yeah, yeah. I have like 200,000 followers on Instagram. Yes. Nice. Nice. I'm kidding, bro. Yeah? <laughs> Only 135. <laughs> I'm not good in the internet. <laughs> Please fill up your home. All right. How are you? How's it going? Everything is good. You're from originally? New York, New York. New Yorker. Yeah. You are with film we film us now. Yeah. She said made him the shit. Mm. Actually, I don't like very much myself in this. A lot of people, um, a lot of these cabs or whoever, it's like a chain. Everybody's trying to eat from you. So they were trying to they said, Alright, while we uh get someone who's gonna take you over. <laughs> Somebody started trying to sell me cologne. I said, I, I said, no, I'm not interested. I have a bunch of cologne that I don't hardly use. So then, I, it, I talked him all the way down to 50 bucks. He said, because he said 40, he can only just take me to the desert. So I went. I said, I, I don't have time to like play around. Here's 50 bucks. Then he, while before I was going into the carriage, I paid him. He said, I have to pay 200 Egyptian pounds for um 200 egyptian pounds for uh, the government taxes which is it's really the entry fee i think um we, we paid it i went through a metal detector came in he just walked me over here now i'm waiting for him to go inside 
So at 200, it's somewhere around like 13 bucks. Ready? Yeah. Now he's ready. Don't know why he went that way and came back. So now he's ready. And you go over there, you drive the carriage, yep. and you go around like this, people. Got okay? it. I'll get back to explaining later. It's so another pyramid over there. No frontier. This is going to be in the new uh, starting clip. It's going to be in a new one. So once again, I have to wait um, for him to go get the car. That's that's to show me there's so many people, so many chains of people eating, which I can't, I'm not going to be completely mad. People have to make a living. People have to eat. If you were in that situation, people got to eat. It's just annoying. It's just very, very annoying. And also the government always have to make their money. So I understand the entry fee. Um, they have to make their money. So, yeah. What can you do? Just waiting for him. He's coming around right now. I see him. I'm coming from the queen. Now all this is empty. Nothing to inside. I know, yeah. All mommy, body, everything to Egyptian museum. Yeah. And you're standing up say, All this been 7,000 years old. 7,000 years old. This is my grandfather, <laughs> Sphinx. One piece of his stone that's old, one is tall. Face like men, hair like women, body, body of a lion. Face of a man, hair of a woman, body, body of a lion. No news. Why no news? Because Napoleon, it's French, it's Mamluk people. He was here, he took by the bomb, he shot the Sphinx. Yeah, I know, I know. No news now. Everybody look like Japanese now. <laughs> <laughs> no news. Yeah. Same Japanese people. <laughs> the oldest been 7,000 years old. 7,000 years old. Father, son, grandson. I want a ruby. That one. <laughs> First, we go to the Borrama. Uh -huh. Nice picture, all the pyramids in the background. Queen 3 d king. Yeah. 7,000 years old. Each one pyramid, the biggest one, 30 years building. 30 years building. 10 years bring the stone from Luxor. 10 years cut the stone, and 10 years finish the building. 145 meters is high. 145 meters is high. 3 million lots of stone. 3 million. Each one stone 310 and 510. Before, seven years ago, in six years, somebody climbed. No problem. No forbidden. Nobody climbed. Okay. In jail, this pyramid was like this before. This is the cover, marble stone. You know marble? Yes. You see, this pyramid was like this before. Hello, David. Hi, David. All the second two. No?
يلا يا ديفيد So my guy just asked me, do I want to take a picture with the camel? I said, sure. And he said um, that, I, you know, it'll be nice to give the guy something if I do it. So I'm telling you, every, it's a chain. Everybody, I guess it's good in a sense where everybody's looking out for each other, but they, they, everybody got to eat off of you. That's just how it is. But I didn't do it. I could just do a, a, quick, little, um, a quick little selfie. So after this, we're gonna go closer to the pyramids. Uh, from here to the bottom of the pyramid is about, let's, uh, is it 200 steps? I don't know, it looks relatively close, but um, I don't know. Once you start walking, how long does it actually take after the dip? There's a little dip right there, so you can get actually closer. This one, the buses come all the way down there and people walk much further there so yeah we're headed a little bit closer Marble stone, this is the cover before. Marble. Yeah. Marble stone. We just parked the horse. So, there's a pyramid right there. And we just dropped it. So, now I'm gonna go closer. Go closer and uh, touch it as well as take pictures. So, doing the video, right? I'm trying to ignore because the police officer just asked me for a few dollars. Get out of here. He just, how you asked me for a few dollars? Damn, it's serious. So I'm just ignoring him, uh, doing my video. I guess because he said I could put my hand on the stone, I'm out of here. So, <laughs> oh man, it's too funny. Too, too funny. Police officer exit from Brett. And somebody would do it. Like, you're not gonna tell them no, but I'm out of there. Next time, sir, 